push that stress out like it was shampoo. You should stay. It can't change. There's good days and bad days. But one day down the line, this time is sure to stop. So the only time is now for a cup. Change. I'm up and I'm out today, feeling like something got to give, cause I woke up so, so positive, and with a brand new plan, better than my sandwich with ham and jam, better than the lawnmower engine, I attached to my bicycle brethren, better than a free cat fashion, and the catchphrase too, he's that stacking, now I won't deny it, today man I'm so excited, so hyped I can burst at the seams, cause I might get the girl of my dreams, with a plan that's so unstoppable, it's a new day, anything's possible, wake it up to a whole new day. See how loud it can get Me, I walk with a bounce in my step It's a new thing, I want to sing Cause it turns out I got the blueprint For the ideal day With Miss Poppy so I feel great Yeah, I had a lot of other ideas But this is the best one right here See, I thought about a football match Or video games played at my flat Just some activity she might like Like getting that engine off my bike I need something she really loves Something she sincerely does Two tickets, she'll flip when she sees them A musical instrument, history museum Yeah! Waking up to a whole new day bumped into you, actually. Are you okay? Fine. Why? Oh, no. Running. Corridor. Some people. Get no respect for the rules. So, you st still up for the museum Saturday? What, medieval musical instruments? Well, who'd want to miss that? Oh, it'd be great. And, and, and really educational. Lady Grey Museum, Saturday morning. Got it. It's a date. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> Put it away. This is a classroom, not a lending library. Be a bit more like Josh over there. Have you got your homework diary? So can I see it? Before we all die of old age. <laughs> Hello. Sorry, sir. I couldn't hear you. These are banned. Take it to Mr. Biden till he's happy for you to have it back. Till he's happy? I'll never get them back. Excuse me, sir. Mr. Pinder said, wow. I wasn't expecting a house party. Can we help you, Carter? Yeah, Mr. Pinder said to give you this because I was listening to it in lessons. Josh. Check it. I'm getting told off by the whole staff. It's got to be some kind of record, right? Detention. That's the four o'clock club to you, I believe. <laughs> what are you lot? You seen this? Personal appearance by DJ Speedrun. Yeah, cool. Can't afford it, though. It's a free roadshow, you plank shot. 
Yeah, but it's all the way out in Legion Park, isn't it? You've got the train fare, cos I haven't. I'll think of something. I've got contacts. Contacts? What are you, what are you doing? As well as glasses. Oh, dear. Well, we'll have to call you six size. We'll have to call him six size. Six size. Which brings us to the final item, the school council. Oh, is that still going? Perhaps you'd like to share your insights with the rest of us, Mr. Carter. I was, I was just saying, I'm, I'm amazed this lasted so long. I mean, how many different ways can there be to decide where the recycling bins are going? <laughs> <laughs> but I'm sure it's amazing now, <laughs> you know. Go, Council. As luck would have it, the school council needs a new chairperson. Seeing as you're so interested, Mr. Carter, the job's yours. What? No way. I mean... I can't. I'm, I'm, I'm too busy running the four o'clock club. Oh, really? Oh. I got the impression they were running you. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to make a connection. Well, don't. All those in favour of Mr Carter being appointed council chair? Oh, come on. Lend me your music. Well, no way, you've already had yours confiscated. <laughs> Which is why I need yours. Fine. Just try not to get busted this time. Thank you. That's a killer track. Up so high that there ain't no down. Everybody, Everybody see, see me, me hanging, hanging with the with clowns. The... Hanging with the clowns? Yeah. Shut up, man. It's clouds, not clowns. Why would he be hanging with clowns? He's at the top of his game. Compared to him, the people around him are a bunch of clowns. Now he feels. <laughs> up with the clouds. Up where you get clouds. Look. Lots of clouds, zero clowns. It's clowns, you clown. It's clouds, you cloud. What? No, it isn't. It is. It's clouds. No, it isn't. It's clouds. Hello, so sir. It's clouds, you clown. Oh, um, sir, that's not fair. It's, it's mine. Really? Yeah. Well, that'll be detention for you as well, then, Ryan. Oh, but that... Well done. No sweat, ladies. We can use mine. See? It's all right. Detention. Book all sweaty. This is so wrong. It's like cruelty to kids. We're calling the RSPCA. Uh, ties on, Zoe Marie. Uh, if it was up to me, cool, but rules are rules. I've got Byron on my back. So when are they going to get the radiators fixed? You know how long these things take, Agnes. Would you like me to put in a quiet word, sir? No, that's OK. Only it's no bother. No, thanks. OK, uh, a bit quiet, yeah? Um, silent reading. <sighs> Just for today. Look. Got to get all this paperwork done for the school council. Boring. And I need to find another student to join up. <laughs> Good luck, sir. What be easy to find and start a kid they go for? Oh, you should ask Nurse. Uh, I don't think so. Could a school council do this? <laughs> I'd vote for you. Well, why not one of you lot? Nah, cos we're, like, cool and that and not, like, whatever yet. York. They're not interested in what real kids have to say. Well, maybe that's the reason I... the reason you don't rate the school council. Cos there's no-one like you on it. Like me? What are you saying? Say that's my face, yeah? What he's trying to say is the school council would be a lot less boring if one of us was in it. What we're saying is thanks, but no thanks. School council got everything going on. We've got ours. Everyone's happy. You're good with words. Prof, please. Making me blush. So, if you think Josh should be the new member of the school council, raise your hands. No! I'd rather you than us. Come on! Welcome aboard. <laughs> now, this is a smart move. Kind of thing you call a win win, you can't lose. In other words, it's the perfect opportunity to show what I could do for him, he could do for me. Because he'll shine if he starts to work harder. And I could be the teacher who changed Josh Carter. Make him use that mouth for something positive Instead of that fat chat and a lot of lip I can see he agrees these are clever words That's the dumbest idea that I've ever heard I spent two years building up a rep Now my donor of a brother's gonna rip it all to shreds I mean school council Doesn't he know his
it's all goody goodies, nerds and kids with B.O. Doesn't he know how lame I'll find it? I might have to go, but I don't have to like it. So that's decided. Now we stop talking about recycling bins and begin the surprises. I could revolutionize this. Whole school played the fool, but now I could change the rules. Dress down Wednesday, no one wears their uniform. DJ Friday, I could put my music on. Band staff meetings, hate them so much. Marshmallow Monday, toast my own lunch. After that success, I'll get political. First prime minister to ever work within a school. King of the cool in my rightful position. I'll be the ruler and rule with precision. Rule the council, that's just the first step. Rule the country, that could still work yet. I rule the world, I could make mine. Look at him, he could have ruled a straight line. Doesn't he know how lame I'll find it? I might have to go, but I don't have to like it. Okay, let's get this started. Um, first up on the agenda. It, uh, location of the recycling bins. Sir, technically we should start by signing off the school council trip first, sir. A trip? That's more what I'm about. Where are we going? Elmsbury Town Hall. They're debating where to put the new speed bumps. At least tell me we're missing double maths. No, it's after school. On a Tuesday, you won't be missing anything. Except having a life. Yeah, enjoy that. Sir, you're coming too, sir. Wait. What? We need someone to drive. The school minibus. Sir, it's quite good fun, sir. We go every year. They have a tea shop. See what we're dealing with here? A tea shop. Well, you know, let's, let's have a debate on it. You're, you're a school counsellor. Isn't the whole point to debate things? Well, where do you want to go? Well, there is one place. That stupid road show. Yep, that stupid road show is the perfect place to go. How's that? Well, you lot went to the town hall last year, right? So that's history, and the roadshow is the future. Sir, it's supposed to be educational, sir. You learn a lot more when you're enjoying yourself. And you know, the roadshow is all about speaking to people and your teamwork. And I tell you one thing, it is not about speed bumps. Learn that. OK. So, all those in favour of switching the trip to the roadshow? Yes, get in. I, I, I mean, <clears throat> motion carried. Right, so you reckon it's hanging with the clouds? Yeah. Right, thanks, Beth. Right, that's five for hanging with the clouds and four for clowns. Results! And four hanging with the crowds, three with the crowns, and one hanging with two big losers. Molly must have heard a remix. Right, so that's it, back where we started. Me being right and you being an idiot. So if you were wrong, then you'd, I don't know, Dress me as a clown. Yeah. I parade through school. Yeah. And if you're wrong, you do the same. Deal? Deal. Fine. I'll check on mine at home, print it out. Tomorrow morning, you can eat my worms. Word, you idiot. <laughs> Make you prime minister yet? Well, no, but I did get the school to pay for me to go to the Prime FM Roadshow. As it? No, oh, it's true. He taught the council into doing what he wanted. What can I say? I'm a natural. Really? Well, could you get him to ban school uniforms then? Uh. Or ban school? No, seriously. What we should do is make the lunch times longer, and that would benefit the teachers too, wouldn't it, sir? Now, what we should do is get him to do all the girls' lavies, like proper ones, like in nightclubs and stuff with like makeup and towels and everything. Uh, if anybody's got any suggestions, reasonable suggestions, then I can add them to the agenda and we can see if Josh can try and make it happen. Well, uh, how about we fix the radiators? Well, I said reasonable, that'd take a miracle. Well, what if we're allowed to take our ties off in here then? No sweat, I'm on it. Do you fancy grabbing some lunch after the museum on Saturday? Lunch? With you? Saturday? Yep. I'll beat the thrill of a load of old ancient flutes, but <laughs> you could give it a try. Saturday? No. Oh. OK. It's just a thought. No, I, I'm sure I can sort it out. <laughs> or we might have to call the whole thing off. <laughs> I'll be in touch. Do you want to go in the first place? DJ Speedrun dot 
Cool. Loud? Ash can never know. Right, Ryan? Oh, hi, Ash. Didn't see you there. Can't stop. So? Oh, what, that DJ speedrun thing? No, music speaks to different people in different ways. Does it really matter who's right and wrong? Well, you said did. So what did your website say? It said nothing. The, in the internet was down. Like, all of it. Everywhere. Whole thing gone. Really? Yeah, yeah, they take it down every now and then to clean it. I didn't know they could do that. Oh, yeah, all those, all those worms and viruses and that. It's really dirty. Well, you hear stories. Oh, hey, Mel, um, just to let you know, Saturday, I'm still not sure if I can make it or not. Oh, thanks for the update. <laughs> One day we'll have lunch together. One day. I never knew you cared. Not you, sir. I'm not that there's anything wrong with you. I mean, I I'd didn't love... stop you for a lunch date, Mr. Carter. I want to know how the council meeting went. Oh, well, the kids were very enthusiastic. Actually, they had uh, a lot of good ideas. Don't worry, it won't last. And we. Uh... We're going to cancel the, the town hall trip. We're going to go to this Prime FM roadshow instead. What? It makes sense, sir. Because, you know, the kids can learn all about teamwork and communication. DJ Speedrun's playing. Thrilling. You're not cancelling the visit I personally organised in favour of some hip-hop trip. The council had a vote, sir. That doesn't mean they can do whatever they want. But they were so up for it. Uh, and I was going to cancel this museum trip with Miss Poppy on, on Saturday. I mean, I, I don't want to let the kids down, you know, but um, if the order was to come from you... If you like. Well, I guess I'll just have to tell them that you said the roadshow trip is, is, is off. I'm here for my MP3, sir. Come back tomorrow. Jay, I, I, I didn't... Don't even, yeah? It seems straightforward to me. One chance you get with Miss Poppy, and you don't even try to stick up for us. I didn't have a choice. Whatever. What was the point in this whole council thing? <sighs> if you're not even going to take it seriously. Jay, Jay, wait. Hey, hang on a minute. Man, um, sorry. Uh, you all right, Nathan? Yeah. And don't worry about this thing on Saturday. Oh, Saturday. Um, <laughs> might be back on. Oh, right. Half the gods. Great news. Great news. Why do I get thrown all the trouble at me? Big crime this time. It's a double whammy. Cause Byron walked all over me like I'm from Lilliput. Oh man, Josh must become an idiot. He's such an idiot, flapjack, melon brain. And this is just another chance for him to demonstrate. Like all he wanted was to build me up and knock me down. With all the chat behind my back when I'm not around. What a clown, man. I can't believe I did that. For what, little date, little chit-chat? With a girl like Mel, she can smell my guilt. It's worse than when I brush my dandruff in the pound of milk that Byron used for his tea in his own cup. He got sick, but I never, ever owned up. Ten years on, same old story. Grown man, man doing, doing dumb, dumb stuff like he's 14. I know one thing, he can forget the council. He can't force me. Man, he'll get a mouthful. Cause if he thinks that I'll be making wrong moves anymore, he's a bigger mongoose than I thought. I don't think he's coming, sir. Drum club? Next door, Colin. OK, let's get this started. Uh, the trip to the road show. Yeah? Yes. It's off. What? Look, I'm as upset as you are, OK? But this has come from the head. So we're going to go to the town hall on Tuesday, as planned. That's a shame, sir, but I'm sure you did your best to persuade him. Yeah. Well, um, one more thing. To add to the agenda, uh, kids in detention. Should they be allowed to take their ties off? Sir, who cares, sir? Well, Josh cares. Sir, not enough, obviously. Kids in detention are being punished. They don't deserve perks, sir. It's really hot in there. I mean, let's at least have a vote, yeah? Uh, all those in favour? You don't get a vote, sir. You're the chair. Next, Next door! door.
do, Rain, you donkey. Told her to still be ICT while they were cleaning the internet. Cleaning the internet? Is there something wrong with him? Yeah, maybe I should take him to the nurse. He'll live. Find yourselves a station and log on. I'm not going to break the internet, am I, miss? Probably not. Result. Sorry, guys. Ties back on. Council voted against the idea. Typical. Bet they wear the stupid flipping ties in bed. What happened there? But it helps talk about it. They just didn't get it, Agnes. Now, even if Josh had been there, if he'd have explained what? that... He wasn't there? What was he thinking of his, like, non-existent head when he wasn't even there? Thank you, Zoe Marie. Oh, all right, loser. And why weren't you there? No point. No matter what the council votes, the teachers always ignore them. Don't they, sir? Uh, don't, don't think we need to go into that here. Yeah, so now we're not going to the roadshow because Mr Carter overruled us. Hey, Byron overruled you. <laughs> and you let him. It's all right, sir. You're just like the rest of them, that's all. But we can get this no ties thing through. We just need to get Josh back on the council. I'm not going back. Final. Come on, guys. Choker's back on. Wouldn't want to break the rules, yeah? <laughs> Making one of your special hot dogs. Not talking to me. That's cool. I'll, I'll, I'll get that. I should have stood up for you with Byron, I know. I just waited so long for a date with Miss Poppy, you know, and... Still... Let everyone down. I'm sorry. Apology accepted. Jay. Mm. I need you back on the council. Mm? I need you to change their minds about the ties thing. School one for the four o'clock club. Mm -mm. You got yourself in this mess, you clear it up. Please, look, I'll drive you to the roadshow myself. I I'll cancel my date. You know how much that meant to me. What about the rest of the council? Fine, they can come. Touch. Oh, Josh. <laughs> OK, OK, I get the message. But do you, Ryan? Do you? Get that out of your face, OK? You were right and I was wrong. Let's just leave it at that, shall we? If only we could, Ryan. If only we could. Cheer up, mate. Clans are supposed to be happy. <laughs> uh, hey, Mel, you know this museum is on, it's off, it's on, it's off, it's on thing? Yes. Oh, it's off. That's fine. Definitely this time. Seriously, Nathan, that's absolutely fine. Sorry. Could be more fine. To be honest, once you've seen one 18th century desk camp recorder, you've seen them all. I, I, I really did want to spend the day with you, you know, but it's just... Uh, it, see, the thing of it is... <laughs> oh, <Ryan>. oh, man. <laughs> At least things can't get any worse. Think again, Krusty. You can't have a clown without... a custard pie! Oh, 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 no, oh, come on, Ash. <laughs> enough is enough. Shut up and take it like a clown. If you're doing what it wants. Put it away, Ash. Detention! All of you! Forever! <laughs> the look of Bugger's face. Yeah. Worth it, though. <laughs> Definitely worth it. Yeah. When he says forever, you don't actually think he means it, do you? Probably not. Good. <laughs> Wait. Coco. <laughs> Chuckles. <laughs> What do you think this is? Some kind of circus? <laughs> Ladies, gentlemen, this way. What are that lot doing in here? Are you afraid you're going to catch something, like not being a wazzock? Oi, stop it. I said I was going to talk to the council about it, and so I brought them here, Dad. 
So why are we doing this oven, sir? See, now that's the problem. That radiator has been blasting out heat for the past two weeks and there's no sign of it getting fixed. Yeah, it's supposed to be detention, not a sauna. So now you see why the kids want to take their tyres off. Yeah, good idea. Well, hold on, let's make it official. All those in favour? All right, motion carried. Yeah! yeah. 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 So, uh, see you at the next meeting. Actually, sir, we're not sure you should be the chair anymore. We need someone who will stand up for us and well. We don't think that's you. What? It's a bit harsh. Although, if that is how you really feel, I could uh, save you some time and resign right now. And if he's out, I'm out too, you know? <laughs> the Carter brothers stick together. Thanks for coming. <laughs> School council? And what were you thinking? Donut. <laughs> <laughs> I promised you a trip to the road show. No one said anything about it being comfy. Oh, I can't believe the council chose to go in the twins' beamer instead of this donkey. Oh, shove up, you bum hat. Whose leg is that? It's yours, dopey. <laughs> Mine? You got room for one more? Hey, Mel. Oh, my neck is shot. No, shut up. I love DJ Speedrun. Even more than I love staring at a heap full of bad pipes. <laughs> Everybody see me hanging with the clouds. Everybody see me hanging with the clouds. Oh, go high that there ain't no doubt. Everybody see me hanging with the clouds. Oh, go high that there ain't no doubt. Everybody see me hanging with the clouds. Oh, go high that there ain't no doubt. Everybody see me hanging.